Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to look at mean, median, and mode. And so the mean, median, and mode are all ways of describing a list of data. So what is the mean? The mean is the commonly used uh, average calculation where we add up the list of numbers and divide that sum by the amount of numbers in that list. So example one, determine the mean of this set. So we add up our numbers, one, two, two, four, five, six, divide it by the number of numbers in there, one, two, three, four, five, six, like that. So we have 20 over six, which is roughly 3.3. So the mean of this list is 3.3. So practice number one, determine the mean of the following lists. Go ahead and pause the video and answer that. Okay, we're back. So we are adding up the numbers. First one has six, so we add it up divided by six, which gives 5.2. B, add up the numbers, also six divided by six, the amount of numbers in there. 61 over 6, which gives 10.2. C, we add up the numbers, and this time there are 5 of them, so divided by 5, so 680 over 5 is 136, like that. So it's that easy. Median. So what we're going to do is you order the list from low to high, then the median is the value in the middle of that list. If there's no exact value, we take the average of the two middle values. So example two, determine the median of this list. So we notice we go middle, middle, middle. So two and four are the middle. So we add it up and get the average. So two plus four over two gives three, like that. So the median of this list is three. Practice number two. So go ahead and pause the video and find the med median of those lists. Okay, so A, we go to the middle, which is five. It's already in order like that, so that's good. B, we have to reorder it, lowest to largest, so we order it like that. The two middles are 10 and 10, so the 10 plus 10 over two is 10, so the 10 is our median. C, the middle of this list here is 150, like that. Okay, and last but not least, the mode. So the value that occurs most often in the list, that's what the mode is. So we look at this list, one, two, two, four, five, six, the mode is two. So there can be no mode, right? If none of them occur more often, like if they all appear once, there's no mode. There can be one mode, like in this example, or many modes. If it was one, two, two, four, four, five, six, then the modes would be two and four, like that. So it's possible to have many modes. So practice number three, determine the modes of the following lists. Go ahead and pause the video and do that. Okay, we're back. So A, uh, the mode is four and seven because they both appear twice. B, they all appear once, so there's no mode. C, uh, mode is one. And D, the mode is eight, like that. So a nice little practice just to be at the end here. Practice number four, determine the mean, median, and mode of this list. Go ahead and pause the video and answer that. Okay, we're back. So the first thing is to reorder it because it's not in order. Now that's in order, we'll calculate the mean, add it up, and there's seven of them. So 73 divided by seven gives about 10.4. Median, middle, what's in the middle? Three, like that. And mode, what happens most often is three, like that. And that's it. It's that easy. I'll see you guys in the next video.